Hey Justin, how you doing? So, I've got your work here, and I'm just, I'm looking at it, and the one thing I don't see, Justin, actually, I should start by saying everything's looking really, really, really awesome. I'm not seeing much by way of written um, rationale, so I'm just, I'm just kind of stuck on uh, commenting on the visual um, and not the the thought process and not the thought patterns and not the, the, the cognizant approach, um, the method, your methodology, your conceptual approach to the project. And that's the thing I can't comment on with only um, images. So, I mean, and, and the reason we, you know, I, we talked about this a little bit about the fact that, you know, things change, the, the screwdriver changed, that, I mean, the, the paint roller, everything changes. So, it stands to reason that, you know, we talk about all that because I, I want you guys to realize your work needs to change drastically. I mean, uh, there's no way that a final solution can be maintained or, or achieved in two weeks. And that's why I am keep on pushing students to change. Think further, think deeper, think more, think wider, broaden your scope. Let's get a shotgun approach and then narrow it down as opposed to, um, starting out Olympics and then building out like this. Do you see what I'm saying? So, and the reason I say there's a couple, a couple of different reasons. Okay, you have Aspen 2022 Winter, Winter Olympics and then Ajax Mountain. What? I mean, obviously this makes sense. Okay, you have the logo, the rings, and then the, the, the text and then the image. Okay, and then you have Ajax Mountain. So why is that even there? Unless you're going to have Ajax Mountain and then Dit Dit the Mountain and then Dit Dit Mountain and you're going to label some other different things, it makes no sense that that's even there. Do you see what I'm saying? The next thing I notice is this is not the same logo that you're using over here. So those kind of inconsistencies and this would be a kiss of death right here in a portfolio. Imagine you're sitting in front of me and I'm interviewing you for a job, okay, and and and, and we're, we're looking at this and I say, Justin, um, why is this logo here different than the one in, in the, on the cars? And boy, if you don't have a gosh darn solid answer, quite honestly, that interview might as well just end right there because it's an inconsistency. Okay. And, and these are the things that we really, really need to train ourselves to, to really spot early and to eliminate very, very early in the process. So it's like right now, for instance, you have logo research, but I, I, I mean, I, I don't know what, like what, which is the logo? I mean, here I am I'm almost in the third or fourth page of the presentation and I still don't know which one is the logo. Um, you got some nice assembly of images. There's back to the original logo. We got this logo, then we got this logo, then we got this logo. Do you see what I'm saying? I'm lost and I have no clue which is um, logo exploration. That's really nice. I like that a lot. In this kind of program, this I want you to understand that this isn't a, a design narrative. This isn't a process book per se. It's, it's, it's a presentation. So you're not going to have logo explorations in here. Um, and then these aren't final outcomes either. These are still obviously still mock-ups. So let's not call those final outcomes because they're not. Um, love this piece, man. This is this is just such a tight piece. And the background, I mean, you're saying a lot here. You really are. First of all, if we look at the actual mark itself, we say, okay, um, that doesn't, we don't know what that is. Does that make sense? No, it doesn't. Then we looked at it in the context of the Winter Olympics with the logo. And then we go, okay, that's a bobsled. There ain't no two ways about it, right? So that's awesome. And then you've added this cool meaning in the background by using these very, very cold colors and giving this kind of, not, it's not motion. It's not even tacky like motion. It's just the way that this thing sits, it's a gorgeous, gorgeous piece. This is by far the strongest piece in all of your presentation, this piece right here. Just absolutely gorgeous. Um, okay, so uh, that's where I'm at. So um, 
Yeah. Any questions or comments about that? I, 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 I'd like to see you go, keep on going further, going stronger and going harder. So let's see where we can go. Um, awesome job. If you have any questions, I'm right here. Thanks.